four months after the season started, so you're doing it, and then the team also. You got you different, the same? How are you? I'm definitely different. Um, you know, I just I just feel like I get smarter with more experience. I mean, obviously, I've been in college three years already. Mm -hmm. I played three years at Iowa, so I just feel like my my mindset just got way better. You know, it's not all about scoring and offense, and that's what I preach to the team every day. You know what I mean? Obviously, offense is going to go the way it wants to, you know what I mean? I mean, people have bad games, bad shooting games. Um, but I tell people, you can't control your effort, you know what I mean? You can't, you can't control playing defense, playing hard. So I, I try to preach, you know, playing defense and, you know, just trying to keep my, le my level of effort high every single day that I come in. How is the Big 12? Um, how have you adjusted to it? You, you know, you, this would be the Iowa State's team you haven't played yet, but you studied them. Um, you went through the Big, Big Ten for whatever three years. What have you learned about this league and how do you have to play maybe differently than you did in the Big Ten? Uh, for one, there's no nights off. Um, I think Eric said this a couple weeks ago or like last week. I mean, there's no nights off in this league. I mean, you're playing against a pro every time you step on the floor. So, I mean, you can't take plays off. You can't take possessions off. You can't take anything off. You can't take nothing for granted. I mean, every play is hard and almost every possession matters. And I just felt like that's just the difference between this league and any other league. When I watch, I, I watch players, you know, just take plays off, you know, stand in the corner, but not really guard anybody. But you can't do that here because everybody on the team is really good on every team. So you can't, you can't take possessions off. Iowa State leads to Big 12 in steals. Um, they turn people over. How do you uh, approach this team from what you've seen so far and how you study them? Um, I mean, credit to them, they, they turn people over, but I mean, I just feel like we have smart enough guys to not put ourselves in those positions. I mean, obviously, you know, turnovers happen uh, throughout the course of the game, but I mean, I just feel like, you know, if we don't put ourselves in bad positions, then, then we'll be fine. Joe, kind of along those lines of scouting at Iowa State, when, when you guys watch them, and obviously you don't just watch their home games, I mean, you watch their most recent game, it seems like they're a much different team when they're on the road as opposed to when they're on, on home. I mean, do you guys see that, see that? And, you know, is there any kind of explanation on how a team can, you know, can beat Kansas by 16 points at home, but then turn around and, you know, lose to somebody on the road that they probably shouldn't have lost to? I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, definitely. That was one of the points what GJ told us. He was just a scout. That was one of the points he told us. I mean, they're a completely different team on the road. Um, yeah. And that's no, no knock on them. You know, they're still a really good team. But they're obviously, you know, there's just holes in their games when they, when they get to the road. Or, I feel like it's really hard to play in the hill team. I mean, there's yeah. uh, that, that crowd is ridiculous. Their fan base is ridiculous. So, you know, they don't have that behind them when they're on the road. So I feel like that's why they struggle a little bit. You played there, right? Hilton, yeah. right? Yeah. That's yeah. That's nuts. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, I played there. <laughs> that, that place is rowdy. That place is rowdy. Defensive uh, scoring average lowest in, in the Big Twelve. How do you get your mind prepared for playing a, a defensive-oriented game? It's probably going to be in the, the least they want it to be in the sixties. It's just going to be one once or more. That's all it is. I mean, coach been telling us that since we got here. One once or more. You know what I mean? Tomorrow, just whoever whoever wants more is going to win that game. And um, you know, I'm just preaching to the guys. You know, we, we want it more. You know what I mean? We from here on out, we want every game more than everybody else. Take you well to adapt to this system. From what I mean, Iowa it seemed like it was a different offensive system. Did it take you a little while to adapt? And how um, difficult was it? No, uh, not really, because I mean, at Iowa we, we we did go up and down a lot. I mean, we ran on makes and misses, but I mean, coach told us to do that here too. You know what I mean? Like if you got something, then take it. If you don't, then run a play. You know, so it's kind of different, but uh, not not really. We just don't play as fast as I was at Iowa, but we still do play fast.